have you ever thought to yourself, man, life is like a giant hamster wheel, and I just want to run? Probably not. I really haven't either, but you know what? I got a game that will satisfy that need if you have had that thought. On today's episode of Mumbles, we are reviewing Albalo. Coming up next on Mumbles. No, no, no! Hi everyone, Mumbles here. Today we're reviewing a game literally about running in a giant hamster wheel. I was blown away by it too. I don't really have any funny things to say, but that's what this game is about. So guys, if you wouldn't mind using your little hamster paws, pawing up there, and little, tapping that subscribe button, I'd really appreciate the support. Thank you guys all so much. Now let's talk about this hamster-related game. It's not really hamster-related, but it is, you literally do run in a giant hamster wheel. The description for this reads, and this is going to take a hot minute, so just hold on. The description reads, Avalon is a minimalistic puzzle where the player must understand how to run and why does he do it. That's the description, guys. That, that's, all, that's all that was wrote. This game is available for a price of $4.99 on the Nintendo Switch, and it is available on other major consoles and systems if you're interested. So guys, let's jump into the game review. So what is there really to say about this game? I know I was surprised that I decided to review it too. But basically this game is about running on a giant hamster wheel. I don't mean to keep saying that, but that's what the game is. You basically are put on this giant wheel, and from that giant wheel you have to figure out different ways to earn. I'm going to call them achievements, but on the thing they're little pictures, or whatever you want to call them. So basically you're trying to figure out different ways on this wheel to solve this puzzle of how to get these things on the wall. And that's the game. That's literally the game. You get on this hamster wheel on the Nintendo Switch, you hit A, boom, 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 you're running, 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 and you're trying to figure out what to do. There'll be a little block that appears. You have to jump over it or figure out different ways to do it. That's the game. There's not a lot to say here. I'm sorry. Con-wise, guys, this game, I like the idea of it, but it gets old very fast. Very fast. So the first con is that it is very boring. The second con is that I would have liked to have seen a little bit of variation in it. I mean, I know what they were trying to do here, and I understand with the whole, you know, figure out what you're doing from this heat wheel, but at the same time, I like variation. Now, the third con is the price. $4.99 seems a little bit steep for a game that's probably more of a 99 cent game, but that's just my opinion. So guys, now we come to our all important scores section. I have to say, on today's Mumbles Review, this game's only going to get a 2 out of 10. I don't want to discourage the developer and people from trying weird, interesting ideas, because that's how we get some fantastic games sometimes. But I gotta admit, I was bored. I was bored with this game. Uh, I thought that it would be a game that I would be like, oh yeah, man, I can't wait to figure out how to do this. But after seeing how it was and that there wasn't like, you know, different other things to do, it was literally just getting all the puzzles from this wheel. I just kind of got bored with it, guys. I gotta be honest. So I'm only giving it a two out of 10 today. If you're interested in this game, then definitely check it out. And yeah, guys, this is going to be Mumble Sign Off. Please smack that subscribe button, smack the like button, and smack all those buttons. I, I hope you're, you know, pleased with this hamster wheel related review. Um, yeah, this is going to be Mumble Sign Off. Have a great day, everyone. Bye-bye.